Hi guys, and welcome to episode 7 of My Road to Glory. This is Vic, and we get straight into a game against Nuke Bear. Um, whose team we're going to have a look at now? Do a bit of messing about. Okay, he's got a bronze Korean team with Wagner Love and Dumbia up front. Um, for those who don't know, Dumbia's probably this year's Agbon Lahore in a way. He's a bit of a... He's just quick with a good shot and he just charges away anyway. So it's just a bit of a yeah, tricky team to play when you're two and a half stars. Uh, Magna Love there gets in with the goal, so we go one goal down. In our sexy green kit. And then some terrible defending allows Wagner Love just to get ahead of the defence and a bronze defence is never going to catch that guy once he gets a yard in front and he he, he slams it home nicely so not a great start guys 2-0 um, down and playing away and that's that's how it gets at half time 2-0 down uh, to be to be fair though, I had I had had more shots than him, a bit more possession. But as you can see, not for the first time in this series, we've got EA smacked, and EA booted us off the server. I don't know if anyone was playing last night around eight. This is when I was playing this episode. Um, yeah, I got booted off. Um, they were messing around with stars and things. So anyway, we get back in eventually, and this is who we're playing. A bronze specialist team. Um, the two guys up top, uh, Lego Junior and Zaha, they're worth about 40k between them, those two front two. That's just those two. Um, the guy had a really seriously good team and not the sort of team you want to play when you've just got a couple of guys that are any good. So he gets ahead, first goal. Um, not a bad little finish though, nice volley. Like I say, Sars probably one of the most expensive bronzers in the game. Uh, we managed to get one back with Odom Wingy. Still popping up with loads of goals for me, Odom Wingy. I'll show his goal stats at some point, uh, games to goals. Uh, I'll let you know what that is, but he seems to score almost two a game, I think. And that is how the half finished, one all. Quite a tight game, like I say, he's got a really, really good team. Um, and that is a tramp, guys. I apologise. I I have no excuse. I guess I was just afraid of this guy's team, really, and just wanted to get some coins. We're in desperate need of coins in this series. Um, we are not going to make a signing this episode, but we're going to make... Definitely one, maybe two signings next episode. We're going to shore up this defence and improve our chemistry at the same time. Uh, Yutaka goes through to get our third. Um, just a really bog standard goal. And at that point, I think he was too annoyed to care, really. And his game just fell apart, really. He just was barely chasing me down. Um, yes, that happens a lot. Some people actually put the control pad down. I've heard of that quite a bit. But anyway, we managed to get a fourth and a fifth. Fat Yutaka back on the sheet. Um, I've got used to him a lot more now. I got used to his strength and it takes him a little while to get into full pace sort of thing. And that is how this game finished. 5-1. So, yeah, feel bad about the tramp with it finishing 5-1, but there you go. 721 coins. And we are back. And after some more messing around, we managed to get this guy. Quite pleased to get this guy. That's the first guy we've played in ages with lower chemistry than us. You could see from those ratings at the beginning that he had a good strike force. Um, but he hasn't really got, he's got a Lee Peltier, 
who's a good silver right back this year uh, for Leicester. Um, yeah, he's just got sort of a smattering of the odd OK player. But yeah, the whole thing, but it wasn't like a very well structured team. Uh, Fat Yutaka pops up with a big volley. Um, yeah, it's not a special goal, but I, I do like those. I, I think the volleys look really good this year on FIFA 12, so happy with that one to get us started. And Thwe, <laughs> one of the centre backs, I think that is. That that goal is made, raised, and done. All that is all bronze, guys. That is my bronze centre back, a bronze right midfielder crossing that in from the corner. That is good. That's a completely bronze goal. So I'm loving that. Uh, Odom Wingy wouldn't be an RTG game without Odom Wingy scoring. Um, yeah, I suppose that's a bit of a trampy goal as well, so I don't care. When I get booted off, and this goal is bizarre, <laughs> Arden Wingy gets completely cleared out, he just gets back up and taps it in. Um, but yeah, once you've had, a, once you've been booted off in a game by EA, the rest of the night you're just sort of trying to catch up, DNF, coins, everything, so... That's 4 0, and this guy, he had a poor team and low chemistry, and it wasn't anything special at all, to be honest. A little bit of quick fee gets on and Wingy's second. Um, I'm really liking the standing fake shot this year. Uh, I think people are really hypersensitive with their defending. So if you just stand still and do the fake shot, they'll run left or right or try and bring you down. It, it's uh, really effective this year. And then, guess what? <laughs> EA kick us off again and that is all we had time for bad episode but thanks for watching guys